What's happening YouTube it's your boy Tech Tricks back in another video and basically this is from Syndox and it's a 20 watt uh, power block and I'm actually pretty surprised with this because according to the box it has a type C and a USB uh, fast charger as well. First things first though, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit the notification bell as well so you can be notified of next videos to come of tips and tricks and unboxing just like this one. Check out my much below at 1130.ca, hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. If you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below as well. So let's go ahead and look at the Syndox 20 watt uh, fast charging block and we're going to compare it to the uh, 18 watt that Apple made. Um, I think the 18 watt has been replaced, but I don't have the 20 watt right now. So I'm, I'm just going to use the 18 watt. Let's go ahead and unbox this. There we go. Some literature on the back. Warranty card. Let's put that away. Right here. Let's take out the block. There you go. And as you can see, it's super small. There you go. I love these. So basically this will give us supposedly 20 watts we're going to test it out today and let's see if we do get 20 watts out of these and it also has two slots a USB-C and a fast charging USB-A there you go 20 watts as you could see there and we're going to compare it to the 18 watts block that Apple makes as you could see half the size of it right and here's the comparison of it to the 5 watt charger that Apple makes. There you go. It's pretty much one to one. It's a little bit bigger, as you can see there, but you can barely tell. So I love how Syndox was able to make a charger that looks like the 5 watt, have it as a 20 watt charger, and it has two slots as well. As you can see, the Apple ones only has one slot. And Syndox was able to make two out of it. So let's go ahead and test these and see how well it does uh, charging my iPhone 10. Here we go. So here we're gonna plug this uh, tester that we got. Just the USB-C side, USB. -C. Let's do the USB-A first. There you go. Now we're gonna plug this in onto here. There you go. And then we'll plug it into our iPhone 10. The iPhone 10 is about 80% right now. There you go. And as you can see there, we are getting about uh, five, six watts right now of charging. Very nice. Now let's go ahead and put this on the Apple version here you go and there you go as you could see there it's getting about 5 watts so it's pretty similar to each other on the wattage now let's go ahead and do the USB-C there you go we're gonna plug in one of these digital right there and then plug this in right onto there so we could test it there you go, with the 18 watt charger from Apple, I'm getting about uh, 11 slash uh, 10 watts out of it. So that's pretty good. Um, I'm not quite getting the 18 out of it because we are using an iPhone 10. See there, it's going down to eight watts right there. There you go. Now let's switch it to the um, Syndox about eight watts let's see here if we get uh, higher than that with the syndox are about the same as you can see there I'm getting about the exact same thing uh, it's dropping dropping down now uh, eight watts nine watts right there ten watts there you go um, yeah so we'll be getting the exact same thing as these from the 18 watt or the 20 watt which is pretty good because of the size is pretty small it's pretty much half the size of the Apple ones, but we're pretty much getting the exact same uh, quality out of it. So that's very nice. And that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a power block, which is a 20 watt right here by Syndox. 
If I was able to help you, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. If you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below as well. I definitely recommend this because of the uh, small form factor, especially you could still have two different uh, devices charging on from it. You can have uh, one from a USB-C or uh, one with the USB-A, so that's pretty good. Compared to the Apple ones, like I said earlier, they only have one slot, which is not good. This is too big as well when you put it on the it it blocks a lot of uh, space this one doesn't have it doesn't take much doesn't have uh, it doesn't take much space so that's pretty good uh, this one obviously is small but it's very slow charging this is better than this one and this is about the same uh, quality of charge so there you go thanks for watching everyone and peace out